What up, G Life? It's your boy MC Shadow back at you with another video. Make sure you guys like, make sure you comment, make sure you're subscribed to the channel. Um, it does help on my channel get into the algorithm. So if you type subscribe, like, or comment, that's how YouTube throws me into the algorithm. I highly appreciate it. On top, I have a playlist, um, and you can find the videos that you're looking for in their own folders. You know, um, that way you don't have to keep scrolling. And you can find them in the categories. Um, don't forget to check out my second channel, Man of Society, MOD, where we talk about stuff outside of the streets. Now, what I wanted to talk about was something that I was getting asked for was my opinion on hood stocks. Uh, the channel hood stocks. Uh, lucky. Um, for those who are not aware, uh, hood stocks is a channel right here on YouTube. Um, you know, it's a podcast, you know, uh, a feedback one too, you know, go subscribe to his channel. Uh, he has, you know, uh, solid content on there. Um, you know what I mean? Um. He's an individual who brings on people and talk about their life experiences and, and, and a whole bunch of other different topics. Um, now, he's also a rapper, too, um, and he gets down. Uh, he has talent. Uh, I think his stuff, you know, who knows? Maybe one day in the future we could do a rollout together. I think our stilos uh, will coexist, um, you know? So one never knows, you know? Um, but overall... Um, He's a he's a solid individual. He, he he's feeding me. Um, I know homies from his neighborhood. Um, you know he he's well respected in his neighborhood. He's well liked. Um, you know, cause I know individuals. You know, certain individuals out there have made videos and have you know certain issues and, and stuff like that. Um, now for that, that's people's personal like opinions, and everyone's entitled to them. And even if there's people that beef, um, like let's say if if two people are beefing it. Right. And let's say you're cool with both of those people. That's not your beef to pick sides or for anybody to be picking sides or meddling in, in their affairs. You know what I mean? Whatever two individuals have going on, that's between them two individuals and for nobody else uh, to voice any opinion or pick sides. That is how you that's what you're shown in this world. You know, especially behind the walls. You want to survive behind the walls. The best advice I could give you is keep, um, don't stick your nose where it doesn't belong, homie. You know what I mean? If it's not your business, don't meddle in. Don't give your opinion on matters that don't concern you. Because as soon as you do that, guess what? All that shit is now going to fall on your plate. Now, you know what I'm saying? So you better brace for it because now you just involved yourself in the mess. That's why it's not your beast. Stay out of it, bro. That's the best advice I could give. You know what I mean? Because as soon as you throw yourself in there, my boy, then you better be ready to swim, my boy, for your life. Um, same applies out here, bro. If it's not your business, just don't get involved. And, and it's between individuals. As soon as you take sides, my boy, is as soon as you 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 make it your business. Um, that's why it's never good to do that. Um, so I don't pick sides or, or, or say who's wrong or who's right or whatever the hell, you know. Uh, he's a solid individual, Feed Me Cat, who has a Feed Me channel. Uh, you know, I'm subscribed, I watch, you know. He's, you know what I mean? Um on the internet, this is the internet. People will hate and say whatever they choose to say. It is what it is. There's nothing we could do about that. And like I said, people are entitled to their opinions, but it doesn't make it facts just because somebody's saying something. Uh, so I think what it does is feed me. Now, the reason I wanted to do this video is because I was asked, uh, you know, since the whole wedding thing, I had been getting asked um, what I think about his channel because um, some people were saying that you know, he talks about positivity and this and that, but he, he, you know, he, he um, his actions say otherwise and what the will. First of all, you know, like, how is he going to be representing the Raza like that and stuff like that? First of all, Lucky never said he was representing the Raza. Lucky represents himself. You know what I mean? Just like we all represent ourselves, you know, like he's not, he didn't say that he's the voice of the people and stuff like that. You know what I mean? That's the problem that people think just because somebody's on here that they're the voice of the people. They're not the voice of the people. They're the voice of themselves. Because that's all we could be. You get what I mean? Now, that doesn't mean that what we're pushing is negativity. Like, we could give a positive message, right? But we could still have our problems and our flaws because nobody's perfect. You know what I mean? Especially when you come from this world. You're still going to have your morals that you're true to. He's true to his morals. That's why I respect him. Because he's not because he has the same morals as me, but because he stays true to his morals. That's why I mess with him. I mess with people who stay true to their morals. Now, your morals may have flaws in them. You know, as individuals, we have flaws. We better ourselves as day by day goes by. 
You know what I mean? This is not a light switch that you can just turn off and turn on like that. Um, you get what I mean? It's kind of like saying people say that, well, no, well, we're all rasa, we should start the fighting and stuff like that. It's kind of like if I say, uh, if, if if two Mexican guys walked up right now and slapped your mom or your dad, right? Now they got to be a part of the rasa, so you have to speak for them. Are you going to speak for them? You're still going to feel some type of way, like, okay, I know I'm down for the rasa, but except those two motherfuckers, fuck them. That's exactly how it's seen, bro. So you know that people have issues uh, um, that they just need to work on because we all have them. Because I guarantee you, if somebody ran up right now and robbed their parents or slapped your mom or some shit like that, you're not going to want to speak for them. You're going to be the voice of the raza, but not for them. I guarantee you, you're not going to make them a part of that. But why not? They're raza. Let's stop the fighting. You see how you see how there's just stuff that we have to work on, uh, it, you, know, you know, within ourselves. Um, so it's not perfect. It, it, it's something that, you know, with time, um, you know, um, you know, it's a working process. So he does it. He, re, he, re, he realizes that. That's why he doesn't come and say that he's the union. That's why, uh, you know, I give, you know, like my channel, right? I give advice to these kids. You get nothing out of the streets. You, this life is pointless and stuff like that. And I want to see betterment uh, for individuals. That doesn't mean that I'm out here saying that I'm the voice of the people or nothing like that. Uh, I'm trying to, I'm trying to do my part. And, and, and do what I can. You get what I'm saying? Um, but not to say that I want to, you know, be advocating that I'm the voice of the Rasa and stuff like that. Bro, because there's a lot of people that say that they're the voice of the Rasa, but what are they doing for the Rasa? Nothing, they're just saying it. So, what good is that? Or if you want to say you, 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 you're doing betterment, uh, you know, for, for your people and stuff like that, but you're not out there with senators, governors, or people that make difference in the community. If you're just hanging around other gang members and, and telling war stories, I mean, that's not, you know? And I'm not taking shots at nobody on YouTube or, or for stuff like that. Um, I'm saying in general, right, um, when advocating a message like that, um, when, when we're talking about a group, like the Raza, you know what I mean? Like when you're saying that you're speaking for the, for the, in behalf of the people, um, uh, that's what I mean. Um, that's why I don't say that. I, I could only speak for myself and do my little part. You know what I mean? Uh, do what I can with people that watch my videos and stuff like that. You know, I could only speak and do, uh, what I can, but that's why I never say that I'm the voice of the people, because if I say I'm the voice of the people, that means I have to be out there in them communities. I have to be out there with, 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 with senators and, and, and mayors and, and, and trying to make a difference for the Raza. That's what it means to be the voice of the Raza. Uh, so Lucky never said that. So for individuals to be like, how can you be and say this, this and that and, and try to grill them uh, because of how he is. It's like, bro, that's it. And that's the thing. If you dislike somebody for how they are on their on YouTube, as our videos are optional, you don't have to watch them. If you dislike an individual, you unsubscribe and you go to the next channel. That's the beauty about YouTube. You don't have to watch and you can subscribe and unsubscribe to whoever you choose. But to still be there on a day to day and complaining is like, then bro, why are you watching though? You get what I mean? So I think what Lucky does is good shit. I got no problem with his podcast. I think he's he's a firme vato. Um, he's true to his morals and he is who he says he is. You know what I mean? A, a solid individual from the streets. Um, who's now trying to, you know, make a difference in his own way. You don't have to love it. But at the same time, you don't got to hate it either, bro. It just is what it is. But that's just my overall opinion on his channel. He's a firme vato. I dig his content. And who knows, maybe one day we could do a roll out or, or, you know, I could bring him on or, or whatever, you know, and, and see what's cracking. You know what I mean? Um, if he's down for an interview, I'm down to interview him right here on my channel. Um, you know, he's, 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 he's cool people. Um, but that's just my overall opinion uh, on Hoodstocks, you know, for those who were asking. And shadow we out.